Good day and welcome with to this tutorial class. My name is Uluwatumbi Blessing Olalekon, the founder of Michael Tech. All right, so for this particular tutorial video, we'll be looking at the question on the screen, which says uh, to construct a regular pentagon with circumscribed circle of diameter 100 with circumscribed circle of diameter 100. All right, so to do this, the very first thing we are going to actually do here is to produce a thin horizontal line in this order, like this. Okay, so after producing that thin horizontal line, okay, so the next thing is I'm going to pick my compass and produce a circle of diameter 50. Okay, so with this being my ruler, all right, I place my compass on mark O, then I pick mark of what? Mark of 50, which is this. You see, that's a mark of 50. With that mark of 50, I pick my ruler first of all. I create a midpoint right here. Okay, I can call this uh, point O. You understand on that line. So afterwards, I'm going to what, place my compass with radius 50 and what? And produce this circle. So I'm going to produce a circle with a thin line. Okay, whatever I'm drawing now, they are all made with what? With thin line, thin continuous line. Okay, yeah, as a construction line. So after producing the circle, I'm going to denote uh, this first mark where my circle touches the line as mark A and this other side as mark what as mark B. So since we are actually producing a pentagon using a circumscribed circle, the very next thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to divide the distance between mark A to B into five equal parts into five equal parts all right so since 100 is actually an even number and it can be divided by uh five easily then each of the mark there will be what mark of what 20. so i pick my ruler i step off mark 20 each the first spot second spot all right third spot fourth spot and fifth so zero one two three four and what five that is it right there okay so what is the next procedure now what is the next procedure okay i'm going to pick distance a b so place my compass at a to a to b okay with distance a b which is this i'm going to produce an arc from mark a first of all towards the top do you see that arc towards the top the first arc right there okay then from mark b with the same length a b i produce another arc towards the top another arc towards the top all right so the axe i produced towards the top yeah with length of what a b first from mark a i draw then from mark b i draw so they meet at this junction right here okay so from that junction i'm going to what pick my ruler then draw a line through mark of what mark of two okay i'm going to draw a line through mark of two you see through mark two from that intersection right there so through mark two you can also draw that one also what faintly draw it faintly okay so that is that line through mark two so drawing through mark two it touches my circle at this spot right here it touches my circle at this spot right here so i, I can call this spot what spot c spot c so the next procedure is to pick my compass all right so picking distance of what a to c which is this distance of a to c which is this then what step it off on the circle so from a i step this right off here with what length ac then from c also i come here what i step this off do you see that okay then from this junction with that same length i what i step this off and if you follow me from this you can see the intersect right there so what's the next procedure the next procedure is to pick my ruler and what and join the points all together so from this spot to a like that so uh, let me use the smaller ruler so from mark a to c i'm going to what join so only the pentagon will be denoted with thick line all right with thick line with thick line other things you've drawn earlier on will be what they should be thin line they should be thin line okay all right so this spot down here all right then this junction to c okay as you can see so that is it so that is our pentagon using the word the circumscribed circle method so kindly ensure you subscribe to this youtube channel and also refer this video to your friends who might be in need of it all right so let me just drive this in had it been the length given for the circumscribed circle is something like 105 or 110 you know in such scenarios uh or let's say like maybe 97 you understand or 96 
maybe like an odd number that is not uh divisible by five that when divided by five we'll be having something of a fraction or decimal so the principle we are going to apply there is the principle of division of line technique to actually divide the total distance into what into five equal parts and to learn this you can actually check through our youtube page you see division of line division of line technique all right so thank you very much ensure you follow us on our social media page on facebook on instagram and on uh youtube also which i expected to have actually subscribed there so on facebook is michael tech instagram at what as michael tech all right so thank you